This episode was brought to you by Pentester Academy, the leader in online cybersecurity education. Join over 10,000 professionals from 90 countries to learn security online. Also brought to you by Hacker Arsenal, artillery for cyber warriors. Visit us on HackerArsenal.com to check out our latest attack defense gadgets. I'm Marley Oxenholm from Pentester Academy TV, and welcome to our show, The Toolbox, where we showcase the latest and greatest software tools so you can use them to better your security. I have an awesome tool to show you guys today. Let's take a look at Zerosploit. Zerosploit is a penetration testing toolkit for network attacks. It can perform network mapping, port scanning, and man-in-the-middle attacks like HTML and JavaScript injection, content interception, and replacement. Zerosploit is based on BetterCap and Nmap. This tool is written in Python and was developed by LionSec, who is at LionSec1 on Twitter. Now, you're probably wondering how to use this tool. We'll take a look at this great example. In this demo, we will observe how Zerosploit can create an MITM scenario and then replace a file that is being downloaded by the target user with a Metasploit backdoor. First, let's run the script and check the help. Now, we need to set the Ethernet interface name, which in this case is Etho. Then, we can run a scan on the network using scan command. We can observe the details of other systems on the network. We can also observe that it has correctly identified that our target machine is a virtual machine. Let's enter the target machine's IP address. We have to search the modules available to launch an attack. Here, we are going to launch our download module, which will replace the files being transferred over HTTP with a specified file. Now, let's use and run the module. Next, we need a backdoor file, which we can generate using MSF Venom. Let's check the attacker's machine IP address and create a Windows reverse TCP interpreter shell using MSF Venom. Copy the backdoor.exe file path, feed it to the script, and press Enter. We also need to launch Metasploit Multihandler to handle the reverse TCP connection. When the target user tries to download a binary file from a website over HTTP, it will be replaced by the backdoor.exe. The target user will complete the download and open it. As soon as this backdoor executes, we will get a meterpreter session on target user's computer. This reminds us of the dangers of using untrusted networks. We encourage our viewers to use a virtual private network whenever possible. A VPN will keep your browsing private and also protect you from such injection attacks. Well, that's all the time I have for you guys today. Thank you for watching, and I hope you enjoyed this tool breakdown. Be sure to tune in next time for another episode of The Toolbox. Also, make sure to subscribe to our YouTube, Twitter, and Facebook so you don't miss out on any of the latest cybersecurity news. This episode is brought to you by Pentester Academy, the leader in online cybersecurity education. Join over 10,000 professionals from 90 countries to learn security online. Also brought to you by Hacker Arsenal, artillery for cyber warriors. Visit us on HackerArsenal.com to check out our latest attack defense gadgets. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.